So here are the specs of the ROG ROM. The security patch level we get here is 1st of May 2022 which is the previous month 1 and the ROG ROM version here is 13.0.3 OBX ROG edition ROM. The kernel here is just the same. Now moving back these are, this is the info page the about phone page. And here is the MIUI 13 and the check for updates but the updates will just not available here. So yes now moving back this is the settings page. The UI here is just the same. As you can see the icons have been a bit changed but there are also bugs which I'll show you later in the video. So, so watch the video till the end. This is the control center the MIUI control center but, but the icons here have been changed. So first of all looking at the settings, the customizations we get to see apart from the MIUI, the wallpaper and personalization, lock screen, everything here is just the same. Then in the display and the refresh rate we also get to see the 90Hz option available which works fine. Now moving back, this is the display options are just the same and if you are noticing while moving back this is a bit updated like bit customized the back gesture. UI then moving to the sounds and vibration here also everything's just the same nothing's new notification and control center we can switch between the control centers from here this is currently I'm using the MIUI 13 style control center but we can also change it and just turn this option off and the control center will change to the original one like which the one which we get in the Indian ROM the MIUI 12 control center as you can see this is how it looks the MIUI 12 control center there are no theming options in the MIUI 13 control centers but in the 12.5 we get to see the those accents and everything but here we can we only just get to see the icons nothing else then we get to see the smart home the status bar options available the low battery notification and everything these are the options available here then in the launcher there are many op new options available so which uh, you can see the gestures the home screen app home screen search bar and the animation speed option we get to see here currently i have set to relax and this is how the relaxed animation feels as you can see this is the relax it's slow and smooth fluid and the relax animation here it's just great now let's just change the animation to to balance and the, the animation speed will become a bit fast but it just feels great the balanced animation now let's change to fast and the animation will become very fast as you can see I don't know if you are noticing or not but the animations have become fast there are no lags and stutters in the animations the animation speed we can adjust from here the fast balanced and re relaxed the balance here are the perfect but I like the relax then we can also adjust the animation speed simple animation the decent corner radius and everything the change icon change icon title color in desktop so these are some all of the customizations of the ROG ROM available here in this launcher settings the enable blur in search bar icon shadows disable unlock animation so we get to see the unlock animation this is how it looks the unlock animation currently and if we want we can turn it off then the reboot launcher everything the arrange item in recent this is the currently horizontal and here we get to see the animation style currently i am running the ios animation style as you can see this is how it looks so these are all the apps open and when i close it as you can see this is a bug i close it as you can see this stays there only it just doesn't come forward the default one the cubic and the style 4 this is you can see this is the style 4 how it looks then the ios as i already showed you and this is the cubic one and the default one we get to see with the miui but the ios here kind of looks cool and it just looks great okay then moving back these were the launcher customizations available there are a lot of launcher customizations in this room 
the fingerprint and screen lock here is the same the privacy protection battery battery backup on this room here is good we will get around four hours of screen on time so that's great then in the battery we get to see the save battery balance mode and the performance mode the ultra battery saver here is available the battery apps and in the more instead of additional settings we get to see the option more here and it has been changed to more the notification light here option is available but it's just not working working only while charging the assistive touch here is available which is the quick ball it has been the name is changed to assistive touch just like the ios one the one handed mode here is available which is working fine but many most of the time it just don't work as you can see then in the screen time here is available and in the special features these are the options the sidebar camera assistant and everything the sidebar is turned on and now we can change the sidebar position just press and hold on the sidebar and we can change its position from left to right top bottom whatever we want so now we can change the sidebar position also in the MIUI but it's still not available in the global room these were the settings and the more additional features available here in this room the MIUI ROG room otherwise the icons has been changed these are not the default icons themes these are the two themes available here the ROG lime and the gradient and apply as you can see these are the lime icons it's just the same and now we cannot change to the default icons this is the lime theme available and this is the control center this is the notification said the as you can see the status bar here has been changed so yeah the theming here sometimes works sometimes just don't work the icons just don't change sometimes and the wallpaper just says the same the lock screen everything so sometimes there are problems with theme and i'll show you this is what it happened at the time when i changed the theme to lime as you can see the dog drawer uh, on the dock the icons just the icons just disappeared and i wasn't able to do anything so i had changed the theme and it just worked fine so this is the lime theme available here now talking about the widgets we all we get to see all the miui 13 widgets which we get in the global which we get in the eu rom chinese roms and everything these are all the widgets available here so no widgets here are missing out everything here is available talking about the camera here we get to see the miui cam and which just works fine no issues as you can see these are all the features available and we get to see the sticker avatar available here as you can see the sticker avatar here is the sticker avatar available and which is currently not working fine but it should work fine so on the camera all the features are available working fine the google camera here is also working absolutely fine no issues with the google cam talking about the performance here are the geekbench scores let's just test this geekbench score run cpu benchmark and see how much it scores and the scores are 532 and 1556 so the scores are great amazing the performance also overall there are no issues the performance just great there are no lags or stutters the animations are smooth and everything just feels great we can use this as a daily driver if we don't use the banking app because the safety net status has not passed the safety net status has failed and the banking apps here are just not working and as you can see the device certification is not certified but we can pass the safety net status by routing the phone by using the magisk so if you want to use the banking apps in this room then we have to use the magisk manager and flash the module the safety net check module otherwise the room here is just great everything is working so far good there are no such bugs only bugs with the ui sometimes with the themes otherwise everything is good fluid and great everything works fine only the banking apps and the themes sometimes shows the bug and the recent bug as i had shown you previously so yeah 
this was it for now if you enjoyed this video then don't forget to hit the like button if you are new to this channel then please guys subscribe to the channel and if you have any questions then you can ask me in the comment section below or in the telegram group i'll meet you in the next one till then stay safe have fun and bye <laughs>